list. So these are in no order, but I have a birthday wishes Barbie, just a happy birthday um, Barbie doll. And I have the 2019 holiday Barbie doll. These are some of my all-time favorite Barbie dolls. I think they're super cute. I got the holiday, like I've never owned like a holiday Barbie. I used to have like a bunch of Barbies, like different types and stuff. But unfortunately, when I was a teenager, I made some bad decisions and I threw them away and got rid of some. So yeah, I made some really bad decisions, but this is actually my first holiday Barbie I've ever had. It's a 2019 holiday Barbie. I really wanted to get the black Barbie too, but they didn't really have that one. You know, and I didn't get in time, but yeah, she's a 2019 holiday Barbie. I like her colors. This is the reason why I got her, because I like the whole like bright red, bright red lipstick. I like her eyebrows, her makeup. I liked how her platinum blonde hair matched like the like candy cane like dress, super cute. And it's 2019 holiday Barbie doll. Tease the season to smile wider, to hug your loved ones a little tighter, and savor that magical holiday spirit. Let each cherished memory warm your heart as we look ahead to joyous occasions, reflecting the sparkle and jubilation of holiday festivities. 2019 holiday Barbie TM is the definite celebration of a season full of love. And um, she's super cute, and she looks like this on the back. And yeah, I really wanted to get the black um, holiday Barbie, but there wasn't enough time. It's a Barbie signature Barbie, 2019 holiday Barbie, Barbie signature. One of my all-time favorite Barbies. And then again, I have a birthday wish Barbie, Barbie doll, happy birthday. And I think this is April's like birthday wish, holiday Barbie or whatever, birthday wish Barbie or whatever. Um, I got her mainly because I really liked her outfit. I'm not a big fan of like her eyebrows, you know. You know, but, um, yeah, I just thought her outfit, her dress is super cute. It's, like, like very eastery, very pastel. And I really like pastel and kawaii things. And I really like the background, like, the cake in the background. It's super cute. And this is one of my also all-time favorite Barbie dolls that I had. I don't remember how much this was. This may have been, like, maybe $30 or 20 or something. I'm not sure. And then I got, um, a Halloween Barbie and a Barbie, you can be anything, pop star Barbie. And this one's actually one of my all-time favorites, if not my favorite that I have so far, the pop star Barbie. Because she is, like, super tan. I really like my Barbies, like, super tan. And I like it when their, like, outfit is, like, on point. She has, like, a holographic skirt and, um, a sparkly, um, shirt and a purple, like, purple hair. That's really rare for a Barbie. Like, Barbie really never changes her hair color unless it's, like, pink or purple, but I thought, I think her whole outfit is on point. She's one of my favorites. Um, her look is one of my favorites of all time, if not of all time. Super cute. Super different. Just pop star Barbie. Pop star is a professional musician, the performers. And she's pop star Barbie. And then I have another one of my all-time favorites. It's just Halloween Barbie. I'm pretty sure I got this, um, last year 2019 Halloween Barbie and I really liked her outfit you know and I really liked the back of the package she's super cute wearing a pink Halloween inspired dress like witchy Barbie very cute astronaut Barbie you can be anything and this is just astronaut Barbie I personally am into science I'm, a, I'm really really big into science and science videos and just doing science in general and I really wanted this I got this from Target and she's just an astronaut Barbie astronaut science Barbie, like NASA Barbie inspired, and so yeah. And then I got, um, I got this, like, maybe Native American or Asian Barbie. And then I got this Asian Barbie. I know for a fact she's Asian. This is one of my all-time favorites, too. Just because I, can't, I don't really find, like, a bunch of Asian Barbies. There's not that much diversity in Barbie if you compare it to, like, rats or whatever. So yeah, I have this um, striped Barbie doll, and she's the Asian one. I also have the blonde one that's on the back, but I don't have the brunette one. Um, but yeah, I have this Asian Barbie doll. And then I have the color changing Barbies that I made. Uh, that I made, like when I got them, I made them and stuff myself. Um, I got the one that kind of looks like Quelle de Ville, like hair that's in a really cute like panda striped outfit. You know, with like a striped black and white skirt with red heels, coral heels. And then I got this one that has green and pink hair parted down the middle. 
died and she reminds me of kind of like Monster High doll. And she has like these cute popsicle outfits, one of my all time favorites too, and her shoes are just pink. Super cute, very fashionista, really cute. They're the color changing Barbie one, super cute. I got this Toy Story 4 Barbie. I thought this was a Toy Story 3 Barbie, but I still like it, it's very cute. It's Pixar's, you know, Disney Pixar Toy Story 4's Barbie. And she's wearing this like blue jumpsuit. They reminds me of like the 80's kind of, the coloring and stuff. Super cute, Disney's Barbie, so yeah. That's one of my favorites too. And then I have that blonde striped dress Barbie, and then I have this black Barbie in like a leopard print. I also have the blonde version, which is the last one I'm going to show in this video of the Barbie, but I have the blonde one. Here's the uh, side by side. I have the blonde Barbie with the pink dress instead of the yellow dress, and the black Barbie, and yeah. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Bye guys, see you next video.